This is how you calculate quarter over quarter and year over year from your data set table. The first thing you have to do is to insert a pivot table. Place your cursor anywhere on your data set table like this and press Ctrl A on your keyboard to highlight your data set table. Next, you're going to select insert on a ribbon, table, pivot table. When this pop-up comes up, select existing worksheet because I'm going to insert my pivot table on this worksheet itself. Then click on this icon here and select the location where you want to insert your pivot table. After that, press enter twice like this. And just like that, your pivot table is ready to be set up. Now, the, on the row section, you're going to insert year and quarter. And on the values, you're going to insert sales three times like this. The reason for doing that is because the first sales will be your actual sum for the sales itself. The second sales column or sum of sales two will be for quarter over quarter. And the third sum of sales three will be for year over year. Let's close this pivot table fill pop-up window here and scroll a bit to the right here. Now, right click anywhere on the sum of sales number two, like this, a context menu should appear. And in here, you're gonna say show value as, and then expand that and then select percent difference from. Once you do that, a pop-up window will come up to say show value as. In here, since this column is going to be quarter over quarter, we're going to select base field as quarter. And the base item, we're going to select as previous and click on OK. Now you can see this is quarter over quarter calculation. Let's change this header to Q over Q so it's more intuitive. And then let's align this to be center and then make it a bit smaller in width. Now for the year over year column, again, do the same thing. Right click any of the sum of sales number three and then go to show values as percent difference from and this pop up comes up. Since again, this is going to be year over year, we're going to change this to year and this is going to be previous. Click on OK and do the same thing here. Change the header to year over year and then align this to be center. And then change the width of the column and job complete.